Hello, and welcome to my Blender 2.6 tutorial about how to create a TV using UV mapping. It's a very simple little demonstration I got here for how to how to do this. So I'm in edit mode. Um, hit A to deselect everything. Select this one face. And I'm going to move it in, press X, so that it moves along the X axis. Looks like a good width for a flat screen TV. Then I'm going to hold down the right click mouse button and stretch this out. Left click to let it go. That looks pretty good. Yep. It's got a good flat screen look and feel. Move this. Let's go to object mode, by pressing tab, shortcut, let's move this up a little bit, there we go. Okay, now I'm going to go back to my edit mode, and I'm going to subdivide this bad boy. Just hit B and make sure all these faces are selected. We're good. Alright, subdivide, one... Baby. Who's your daddy? That's right, old Chris is. Alright. And subdivide. One, two, three, four. You want to be able to get a nice little border in for the edge of the TV. It's looking pretty good. Let's do it one more time. Holy cow. I think that'll do it. Yep, that'll do it just fine. Alright. You press 3 to get the straight on view. Now what I'm going to do next is select the vertices that will be making up the edge of my UV map. So hold down B, select this group, press B, you don't have to hold down B, sorry, you just press it. Select that group. Two down, two more to go. Make that one more. Oh, Control Z, didn't mean to do that. Now I'm going to press Mark Seam. So you'll see this makes a little red line. And this will tell us that that is the area to be mapped. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's change our view real quick. Go to UV editing. Alright, now. To switch back into this mode. Select that group, and I'm going to unwrap. Now this basically puts, takes a mapping of these squares that are highlighted here and puts them into the UV map window. Now it's ready for me to put an image in. Let's go back to our default view. All right, now we're going to have to add <clears throat> a material first before we can add a texture um, and the texture is going to be our video but we'll get to that in a second so new material color is not important so we go to texture new texture we don't want clouds if that is clouds open desktop movie double click alright so first problem there's like three different movies here. We probably only want to show one. We don't want to show like a bunch of different movies playing at the same time. So the way that we take care of that um, is right here. Repeat. Change that to clip. Scroll up. Boom. Done. Next problem. Got to make sure that this movie is going to be playing at the same rate that our uh, Blender animation will be playing. So what we do match movie length. 
that is done. Now, <clears throat> the frames of this movie, the Make It Up, will match the frames that make up our Blender animation. Um, next, we have to make sure that um, this object here knows to use this texture um, to be mapped to the UV mapping that we had that we set up over here. Got to make sure that it knows to take this and put it on there. So what we do, default, is change the coordinates of the mapping from generated to UV. All right, so I think we're ready for a little test render. Test render complete. All right, so we've got our TV there. It's looking looking all right. It's coming along, but there's a problem. You can see there's like a ton more little coyotes all around the borders, making it up. All right, we don't want that, obviously. Um, it would just look weird and psychedelic, man. Don't need all that. So, hit escape, and what we're going to have to do is create a new material that will be the outside of the TV. And uh, so we do this, create new, all right, Got new, what do we want it to be? Black. Sounds about right. And now we also want to make sure that we're applying it to the right part of the television. So let's deselect. With by hitting A, reselect, hit by hitting A again. Um, we are going to change the, the face, select the face select mode, B, and um, again, uh, we're going to want to deselect the this middle part, which will be showing our image, um, because we want to use our new texture, our new material, to cover the other part, but not our movie. So, or our video. So what we do is we hit B. That gives me these little, this little scope thing here. Um, and then I'm going to press my mouse wheel down to deselect the field in which I drag it over. There it is. And now what I can do is click assign and that will set this material to the region that I have selected. So, sign. And let's give this thing one more sample render. And boom, there we go. There is our TV, folks. It's looking good. You know, you can always change the camera angle to what to do what you want. You know, put features on there like a TV stand. And this is a very rough television, obviously. It looks kind of like Nintendo 64 television might, but it is it is what it is. It's a simple tutorial. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, have a good day.